Introduce yourself and tell us what's going on here tonight. Okay, well, um, my name is Raj. Um, I am fairly new to photography. I've been doing point and shoot for years, and two months ago or so, I did the NYU class, uh, which Lawrence teaches, um, from beginner to exhibitor. And my wife told me that I should develop my creative side. So here I am. And over the past 10 weeks, or 9 weeks now, I think I've just gone from nowhere to producing a show which I'm proud of. And, um, and you know, I think everybody has produced some amazing work here, but I just, I'm just blown away by it. So, a lot of the credit has to go to the man behind the camera. So Lawrence has been great, and, and uh, you know, it's, it's been a fantastic experience, and I hope that we'll just continue to develop. Now, you, you, I, I don't think I was cognizant that you hadn't been taking pictures before because you're pretty early on. You showed some pictures that uh, they weren't organized, but they certainly seemed, well, they seemed of this quality, just not necessarily this thought out. Yeah, um, I've been shooting, you know, I've been using a DSLR, but I've been just putting it in order and just shooting, using it like a point and shoot. So, you can say that I've been taking pictures, but um, I've only started to control what I'm doing with the camera in the last three months or so. So, that's probably when I was born as a genuine photographer, so to speak. Okay. Um, so, explain this, I mean, you've told me how, so I know, of course. But uh, because I'm going to show your pictures, I hope that's okay, part no, of the course. thing. Uh, I'm going to show your pictures. I want people to understand how this was done, not only because of the, uh, the beauty you've really, you've absolutely possibly achieved, but the simplicity in how you accomplished that beauty. Um, well, the inspiration came because one day I thought to myself, the lights in the bathroom are too dark. So I added two very high wattage lamps and got in the shower the next morning and the shower curtain was there and the liner was inside and when the water hit the shower curtain I saw all these patterns in the drops and I thought it would be interesting to take a photo. I took a handheld shot of it and I thought this is amazing. So as I started taking more pictures on a tripod and with a macro then I started to realize that it was there was more beauty in that some of them looked three-dimensional that I could play around with the angle of the shot, the angle of the lighting to create, I don't know, um, most of these ones I feel like I can walk into uh, and just keep going and get lost in it and that's what I want and that's what I love about it. Um, and there are others which are flatter which kind of just make me feel very calm and, and relaxed. So, but the majority of them are like the three-dimensional effect like, where you kind of just enter into it and, you know, it's like flying into space or something. So, you know, and I hope I achieve that. <laughs> I, I feel you have. I mean, uh, I think we talked about this so that um, I'd seen a, uh, an article, and maybe, I think I even forwarded it in one of the first emails uh, about somebody using an iPhone yep. with a droplet of water over the lens to turn it into a, a, a macro camera. Sort of giving a similar sort of overall feel because of the, what he was using. Yeah. Um, essentially, you've done sort of the same thing, but uh, in a, a twist. Yeah, a strong, strong, strong twist. I love what you've done here, and I especially love the simplicity again. Thank you. Um, because it. it a point I think I was trying to make early on is that we do not need to suffer for our art. <laughs> no, I didn't. I got very clean. <laughs> and thank you very much, Lawrence, I have to say, for all your inspiration and uh, holding our hands when we need it. Really appreciate it. Well, thank you. I'm going to take a look at the work now.
<laughs> yeah, I think we need at least one close up. Let's see. Uh, no, this is no. no this is the guy. <laughs> this is the guy. This is the Right? See in the green? In the green part? You see one drop. What's in the drop? I see a lot of drops. Right, but look at one of the drops. Right, the big drops. Do you see what I'm saying? It's like red. Even though it's in the green part only. See? 